Hey guys, welcome back to Harrison Hacks. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your Redream emulator build completely portable. Um, this is not a setup guide for Redream. This is assuming you already have it installed. There's tons of different tutorials on how to set this up. It's pretty simplistic. But let's get right into it. I'm going to open up my Redream folder. And my, my ROMs are stored in a ROMs folder inside of my Redream folder. So yours might be named Games or whatever you called it. Mine is ROMs. But we're going to open up Redream. And we're going to set our library. Add directory. Mine is on my desktop. Redream. ROMs. Boom. So now I got my game. And I'll show you. It launches up no problem. Just like that. I'm going to escape and close. Now let's say I want to take my Redream build and I want to move it to a different hard drive, a different folder. I want to take it over to my buddy's house and play some Dreamcast. I'm going to cut my folder. And I have an external hard drive. So I'm going to right click and paste it over here. This is an E drive. The, the drive letter won't matter. But basically, you can put this in any folder you choose once we're all said and done. So we're going to open up Redream. We're going to launch it. And you can see our games are gone. So if we go to Library, it's still looking on our desktop. So you can get rid of this and then go and add where you moved it to. I don't want to do this every time, and I don't think you do either. Boom. Now our game is back, and it's running. Just like that. So we're going to exit out. And now we're going to fix that issue. Super easy. We're going to go to inside of our Redream folder. We're going to go to our Redream.config. Right click on that file. Click Edit. And now we're in Notepad. We're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom. And where it says Game DIR equals we only want this to say the word ROMs. So I'm going to get rid of everything. Now if this is the name of the folder that your ROMs are in. So mine is in ROMs, so that's the name. Just like that. Hit File, hit Save, close it. Quickly show you, we're still on our E drive here. Launch the game. There it is. Now I'm going to take my Redream, cut, and I'll just throw it on my desktop. And now we don't have to change anything. Games are working. You can put it in any folder you want. It makes it completely portable this way. A nice easy fix. So I hope this helps some people. I really appreciate you watching. Please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, but most importantly, have a good day.